if you're new to go cardless then you're going to click this one because you don't have any customers signed up yet so let's click new customers so we have subscription templates which we can have a look at this video is a short part of our longer course which is available on our website so if you're interested in doing the full course then please visit our website below Okay, so let's have a look at the Go Cardless pricing system. So as I discussed previously, they don't take a set amount per month. They'll take a certain percentage of each transaction plus um, a small fee. So there's different options that you can choose from. So the standard option is 1% plus um, 20 pence. And the benefits are you can collect the one-off and recurring payments. You can collect international payments from over 30 countries powered by WISE, which we're going to look at later. They can use Go Cardless with an API um, to integrate lots of softwares like your Xero and your QuickBooks and include your branding in the customer sign up form. Then you have the advanced, which includes everything from before, plus reduce failed payments through intelligent retries. So this is where the AI feature comes in. The intelligent retries is using AI to retry at the best possible time to ensure the most likelihood of success. Then they can also verify new customers' bank details um, at the checkout. And you can have a custom experience from your own payment page to email notification. And then you have the pro version, which prevents fraud by using AI to verify risky payers and resolve fraud by monitoring and challenging chargebacks. And then you have the custom version, which is usually for your larger businesses. So what you can do is you can start, you can calculate what your fees might be. So let's calculate how much we'll be spending. If we were on the advanced plan and we had 100 monthly transactions which is 100 people paying you per month and in each transaction is 495 pounds then the estimated monthly cost is 600 pound this is going to save you 139 pound compared to card payment fees and it also may save you up to six days of time in chasing late payments let's get out the calculator to see what this would look like how much we could be earning compared to how much the cost is gonna be. So if we're making 495 pounds 100 times, we're making 49,500 pounds. And then subtract the 600 pound, so we're still making 48,900 pounds. So there's a significant profit from using this feature. Okay, so this is what Go Cardless will look like on the back end after you log in. And this is if you log in directly to go cardless. So we're going to look at how to set up a payment subscription. So we're going to go to this left hand side and click create payment. So you have the options to request a one off payment, um, a subscription or to collect your payment in installments. So if you have, let's say, a three thousand pound payment, you could collect it in four installments. Today, we're going to be looking at subscriptions. So let's click subscription. Um, set up recurring payments for any active customers or set up recurring payments for customers not on go cardless yet so if you already have a list of customers on your that have accepted um, a direct debit from you have said that they want to you to set up a direct debit for them then you click this one but if you're new to go cardless then you're going to click this one because you don't have any customers signed up yet so let's click new customers so we have subscription templates which we can have a look at um these are previous templates that i've already set up um, but if you are a new person i would want to click create a new subscription and we want to set that up for um let's say 495 every month and we want them to collect it on a specific day of the month so i would collect it on the first of every month in for a specific number of payments so we're going to do three payments now if it's a case of they're on a three-month program but they might continue then you might say until further notice but that means when that then 
that means that when they do cancel, you're going to have to go in there and manually cancel it. If you have a specific number of payments and then it's done, then you can click, you can put in the number of payments. So it's a three month growth plan at 495 per month. And we're gonna put three payments for three months. And then you can also redirect them to a website or a page once their payment is completed. That's up to you. I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna click create subscription. We offer a seven day free trial for anyone who's interested in signing up for a membership to access all of our courses. So you can get access to all of the live workshops, all of the pre-recorded courses, as well as that you can sign up for a 15 minute free consultation. So please visit the link below to find out more. Okay. So a new way to assign customers, you can now easily assign subscription templates to multiple customers at once. So what you can do is you can either copy a link and share it, you can share the QR code, you can invite by email, so you can enter as many emails as you like with a, with a message, or you can add existing customers. So I'm going to, what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this link and then I'm gonna send it. You can send it however you see fit. There's lots of options available. All right, wonderful. So let's click exit. I'm also gonna show you how to create an instant payment. So this is a one-off payment from a customer. So let's say you have the three month growth plan and you want customers to pay all in one go. So it was 495 per month for three months. So that would work out to a total of 1,485. Let's say we want to offer it to offer it to them a little bit cheaper if they pay all in one go. So I'm going to offer it to them for 1,200 pound if they pay it all in one go. So that's a discount of 285 pounds. What you can do is you can get them to make the instant payment now and then you can set it up so that they've approved for a direct debit for future payments. So you don't have to get that approval if you wanna set up a direct debit with them as well. So let's say they pay this initial fee and then you have that one-off payment and then let's say you have six payments of a hundred pound a month, for example. I'm gonna click direct debit. If you don't wanna set them up as a direct debit approved customer, then you're just gonna click instant payment. Um, and even if they're not on go cardless, it's not going to matter. But if you want to do the direct debit system, um, then click direct debit. And also, would you like to reassure your customers by asking them to approve future payments? So here you're saying, I want your permission to take future payments. And then we're going to click create payment. So this payment has been created. So here you have the link. You have the QR code and um, you can also customize this as you want for black or white. You can not show the logo or you can show the go card this logo and you can not show the description or you can show the description. So I'm going to click no logo, show description, save changes. So that is how we are going to actually set up the direct debit system. This video is a short part of our longer course, which is available on our website. So if you're interested in doing the full course, then please visit our website below.